Hi everyone, it's Luis again. I am making another video and in case you're wondering why is Luis wearing a hoodie? Well, because today we're going to be talking about the hooded dendrobium. That was just for fun. Okay, so the Hooded dendrobium is dendrobium aphilum. And the dendrobium aphilum is found in South India, East India, and all the way down to Thailand, Laos, and Malaysia. So the plant looks like this. The dendrobium aphilum is a dendrobium, a character. Uh, Uh, it's, it's a cane dendrobium. So what's a cane dendrobium? Well, it has these canes, right? But it's also deciduous. And, and what I mean by deciduous is that in the winter, it loses its leaves, it goes dormant, and then it comes back in the spring. So this uh, orchid is, uh, is best grown mounted because of the pendulous... Uh, canes. It's difficult to accommodate in a pot because it's going to fall or come out of it. So what you're going to have to do is hang it if you're going to put it in a pot. So as you can see right here, there's a new growth right there. And this is what it does. Uh, you can. This is a, f a tree fern fiber. You can put it in a piece of wood. You could also put it in a decorative pot. And of course, this comes with a hanger so that you can hang it. And this pot, isn't this nice? Uh, I got this from uh, Gloria from the gardens. So, uh, another reason why I made this video is because Mine is blooming right now, and it, the blooms only last between 10 and 12 days, depending on, you know, your environmental conditions and uh, how well it's grown. Um, so I'm going to give you another example of a plant. See how they have these candulous, uh, pendulous uh, canes? And if you look over here, you have the bare canes. This is, these canes already lost their leaves for the winter. But for some reason, this one decided to stay green throughout the winter. And the canes, they start off going up, and then with time, they cascade down. See? So, uh, this is mine in bloom. Ta-da! Isn't that nice? So, in case you're wondering, why do you have those clips there? Well, the reason I have those clips there is because the plant is, is potted a little bit too low in the pot. So what has happened, as the cane grew out, it was up and then fell down. It, it bent right here. So it, it broke one of the the cane, so what I did, I used a brace to help it um, so it doesn't bend and, and hurt it. So that's what I did. As you can see, there's another growth coming out right there. So what you want to do is pot it high in the pot so that the canes have room to cascade down. See? And uh, so this is the hooded dendrobium, dendrobium aphilum, and uh, on each node, I don't know if you can see that, it splits into two flowers. So you're gonna have two flowers per, uh, per butt, basically. So that's that. And uh, it smells like lavender to me. But most of the year, it's not gonna be in bloom. So it usually blooms between um, 
February, March, April. But uh, you could also have do fun things with it, like putting it in a perico. Uh, and also you could do fun things like putting it in a chango. I call him the chango, but he's not a chango. But anyways, that's what it is, the hooded dendrobium, dendrobium aphyllum.